At 37, Cadell Evans is one of the oldest riders at this year's Giro, but with five Grand Tour podium places amongst his palmares, he remains a major threat in the race for the Maglia Rosa. For me to be getting on the top step of the podium, it's going to be take uh, very, very consistent and very good climbing ability to be with the best climbers every day in the mountains. It's a very mountainous, mountainous Giro, and um, I think that's that's going to be the key is being consistent in the in the mountain top finishes, and there are many of those. Evans has always placed highly in the Giro, finishing in the top ten in all but one of his appearances. But his reputation was forged at the Tour de France, a winner in 2011 after twice placing second. 2014 will be the first time he misses the race in eight years. My Tour de France was a race I dedicated 10 years of, of, my, of my life to, or my, my professional athletic uh, life to, and um, fortunately I came through on one of them and won one of them, so that sort of made, that gave me a certain, certain degree of satisfaction. And now to step away from it for me thus far has been um, a, bit of a bit of a relief, actually. Um, sort of eight or six, eight years to wake up every day and have people ask you, can you win the Tour de France? It's a bit tiring, to be honest. And, uh, well, now I'm not even going to be there. It's, it takes, uh, takes a certain level of uh, expectation off my shoulders. And, and, and so, but here I am with, a, with another challenge. He's now one of the elder statesmen in the pro peloton, but with age comes experience and results. The oldest post-war winner of the Tour, his aim this month is to become the oldest ever Giro champion. Above all else, he's determined to remain competitive in the Grand Tours. I don't want to race at a, at a substandard level or a level that's b below where, below the top level. Um, and then uh, as, a, as a rider more experienced, um, yeah, now I have to look at the results sheet to be, see if there's anyone in the race that's older than me. Uh, years ago, I used to see, see how many riders were in contention for the young, young riders jersey. But um, I'd say uh, with experience, it's... Um, yeah, it's you, you. You know, you may you may have less energy, but you know you know much better when to when to save it and when to expend it. The Australian's long and illustrious career started in the mid '90s with mountain biking. A double World Cup winner, Cadell was one of the biggest names in the sport. But even at the age of 21, he could foresee a future on the road. Mountain biking is really my sport. It's what I started with. It's it's you know it's my, that's my job. That's how I earn my living, racing mountain bikes. But uh, road racing is still for me a, a great sport, and yeah, maybe that will be what what my main priority is in the years to come. In 2001, Cadell Evans moved from Volvo Cannondale to Italian road cycling team Saeco. The way in which he summarised his strength 16 years ago, and not a far cry from how many would assess him now. When I'm riding, when I'm training, I um, concentrate on that, do everything as best I can and um, do everything 100%. As a rider, technical skills, um, uh, climbing, power to weight ratio helps, helps on, the, on the climbs and, um, and a, a, an all-round rider I'm now I've sort of developed to the level where um, I can be competitive on pretty much any course I think so that's probably my biggest strength. And weaknesses? Um, ice cream and really cold weather. Evans had to battle some brutal weather on his way to finishing third in last year's judo. While the conditions are unlikely to be as harsh this time around, the route certainly serves up some tough stages. I, I'm, I'm a little bit rational about the stages. I'm, um, if I'm doing well, I enjoy the stage. If I'm not doing well, I just want to get the stage done. We're all, we're all going to be tested right from right from the team time trial and, and the opening road stages. Um, the, the third week, like, like in, in good Giro characteristics, is by no means easy, though. He isn't the outstanding favourite for this race, but Evans is carrying form into this Grand Tour following his overall victory at the Giro del Trentino last month. He's well positioned to bring his race craft and experience into play as the race reaches its crucial stages. Cadell Evans has matured into one of pro cycling's elder statesmen, but his focus remains on the here and now. I have some uh, things in Australia that are interesting avenues to follow um, in, in, in cycling, but also a few things outside of cycling. But. Um, yeah, at the moment I'm still focused on being a, being a rider at the top level and you know, doing my best year to tell you that I can.